don't usually meet with women. I think my husband would like you. What's your name? It's Chloe. Hi, I'm Ella Morton. We're at the red carpet premiere of Chloe, Adam McGoyan's new film. We caught up with some of the stars and the director. Let's see what they have to say. One aspect of the film is how technology can distort or misrepresent a relationship. I think we have things kind of available to us these days that we, that we really didn't have access to before. And the idea that you can check somebody's email or check a text, it's a different landscape, I think, in terms of, of what, you, what is private, what's not private. I have seen a lot of relationships destroyed by uh, text messaging. <laughs> You gotta be careful with those text messages and those emails. The next flight isn't for two hours. I don't think I'll be in before you go to sleep. I'm here with Adam Agoyan, director of Chloe. This is the first film that you've made that hasn't been from your own script. How was that experience different? Uh, it, was, it was really different because I think the blueprint of the film was, was much clearer to everyone involved. Uh, with my own scripts, because they're so layered and there's so many different uh, timelines and they're so much more complex, it's, it's, it's a much more lonely experience and you're not quite sure uh, how it's going to all come together. It allowed me to concentrate on what you do as a director, uh, which is really try and focus on the performances, the way the film is going to look, the locations, the, uh, the way you're going to use sound. You're not rewriting it though as you're shooting, which is what I'm doing when I'm working on, with my own scripts. I'm all constantly thinking about the structure of the whole piece. You shot on 35mm. Why did you make that decision? I just think when you're shooting 35, there's a sense of the moment when the camera is turning, you know, and, and there's that idea that there's something uh, focused about that moment when you say action and when you say cut because the camera actually is going off as opposed to on video shoots, is that the camera just keeps running and it's like there's not that sense of a moment. You know, which is really important, I think, for performers and for me as well as, as a director. This business transaction, which is what this was, is over. Do you think your, your work would look different if you started out now? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, I think that, first of all, I don't know if I'd be making feature films if I started off now. I think I, I'd be way more attracted to the possibilities of, of uh, maybe video games. Uh, I think that there are so many um, yeah, possibilities, right? You know, you could imagine like a story like this being told that way. It would be kind of interesting. One theme that we see in this film and also in some of your previous work is the notion of technology misrepresenting a relationship right. and, and people drawing conclusions that may not reflect reality. How do you feel about technology? How do you think it's changed our communication? I'm not really suspicious of it because it's just the way it is. That's how we've evolved to. I mean, in the earlier films, it, like, I was deeply suspicious and I thought that technology has kind of filtered out emotion and made us lose intimacy. But in fact, what it does is the opposite. As we see now, it, it kind of saturates us with an intimacy that we're overwhelmed by and we're trying to figure out, I think. Chloe opens in the US on March 26th. I'm Ella Morton and you've been watching Rocket Boom.